Learn from those who know. There are many who know better than they do, so I learn from them. Except for preparing for meetings, I hardly read my books. There are those who teach me. So say to that, sir, if you know a little of what I'm privileged to know by learning, not by wishing, things will change. Amen. One of my sons went in with breaking financial hardship and shut off for seven days. He's working in fortune today. He's working in fortune today, sir. He's working in fortune today. Some have, have it all. They have even bought for people, but they have not read it. They have distributed it all over the places. I went for three days. It silenced the noise of lack forever. Two books and my Bible. The Law of Prosperity by Copeland and God's Will Prosperity by Gloria Copeland. And my Bible. And in prayer and in searching and in fasting. It's labor. Imagine I didn't do that. I'm now doing like other people around the world, going from house to house. In fact, you won't be here. I thank God I come to your house how many times? <laughs> so you look for somewhere else to go. Amen. But I'm too glad I've never branched in anybody's house. In all my years in ministry, that can you please assist? No man has had me discuss a need. My needs are met. By light. By light. You can be the one publishing the book, you know, printing it, and nothing will happen because it doesn't come on you by printing. It comes on you by learning. All the one I knew that I've worked with, they were learners to their end. Like T.L. Osborne, like Kenneth Higgins. Every learner to the end. Last time I was in uh, Kenneth Higgins' office, he was reading How Faith Works by T.L. Osborne. He's reading How Faith Works. <laughs> eh? <laughs> Not that he's editing, he's reading it to grab things from it. And then somebody sitting there now, he has not read one thing in his life and he wants it to happen. Some are having Christ in their home. They have never read one book on family like one. One. 